Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. We are watching episode 22 of season 2 of ReZero today. Guys, I can't believe we're this far in the season. We are so close to finishing, we're so close to the finale. Um, and actually, I heard news that the season 3 premiere is going to be 90 minutes long, which I think is happening later this year, maybe sometime in the fall. I did not plan this. I did not plan to watch ReZero in anticipation for the next season, but I feel like this is perfect. <laughs> it's like perfect to be watching this right now, um, so then I can watch season 3 when it comes out. The last episode, at the end of the last episode, we saw Garf reunite with his sister, Frederica. It's been years since they've reunited. Garf is like, I'm gonna take on Elsa on my own. You go rescue Rem. And so I'm a bit scared for him, okay? I really like him. He's really grown on me. I hope he doesn't die because he just got reunited with Frederica. But who knows with this show? Things do seem to get be true, but we we watch, we keep going. <laughs> okay, let's get into the next episode, everyone. We are ahead over on Patreon. We're already done with the show over there by the time it's up on YouTube. And we also have time reactions over there if you want to see my full reaction to each episode but thank you all so much for watching if you're on patreon i really really appreciate y'all if you're on youtube watching us thank you as well but without further ado let's watch episode 22 of season 2 of re-zero oh he loves ram i turn this up too <gasps> Oh, holy shit, <laughs> his teeth. God damn, <laughs> using her hair to pull her. Oh my God. <gasps> Be careful. Be careful, Garb. All right, it looks like we're not gonna be getting an opening this episode because they're showing the credits <laughs> during this scene. Elsa Granhirte. Elsa Granhirte. She actually said her last name. Yes. I love how he calls Subaru a boss. I think that's so cute. Oh man. Oh yeah, now Subaru's here with Betty. He's gonna try and escape with her? Or have her escape this place? But he wants to do it. Betty knows. So she's she's like expecting to die here from Elsa? Fate is blank. No, seriously. Yeah. My god, she doesn't even know who she is. Like, that's... That's how bad it's been. Of course. Oh. Ryuzu. <laughs> That's just not true. It does not have to be like that. <laughs> oh my god. She just like wants any attention from her. なら発揮で言ってやるよ。バカな母親に聞こえるように。白紙の本当に400年前の口約束にいつまでも振り回されてんじゃねえ。お前のやりたいことはお前が選べ。ベアトリス。400年だ。400 
事なもんは絶対譲らないお前がペティのその人になってくれるのあバカかお前<笑>いやお前の<笑>人なんてのわからないやつのわけねえだろ<笑> Oh my god <笑> Holy shit バカダリーダリーお、oh, no. ーマービス。マジュースデニスコラジュニマービス。センゼンキカナイマジュガイルノマジカトースデ。Please, I feel like everyone's everything's gonna about to go wrong. <laughs> Frederica? <laughs> the way she's scaring both Otto and Rem. Otto last? Oh. I can't believe she's still sleeping. Is that a is that a hippopotamus? What the what the hell? <laughs> Fucking Maylee. I hate this girl. Okay, they're going to Rosewald's room? Will that like will that protect them or what are they trying to find there? Rock Piggy? Great name. Let's go, girly. Oh, okay. <gasps> Holy shit, is this another mob beast? Or what is this? <gasps> oh, wow. Okay. That design is so cool, though. Oh! <laughs> There is so much happening right now, you guys. I'm stressed out. She's got her second trial. Oh. Oh god. Could she not see what's in the mirror? Or is Mother Fortuna not behind her in the mirror? Oh. <sighs> Are they having a nice picnic together? This sucks. This is just like a, a what could have been, you know? I think they said this is the future that could never happen. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh my god, she's all mad. She's all mad about that. What? Are these just like people from the village? God, so beautiful. お二人はいつになっても仲良しですね。ジュースも混ざる？一緒に暮らせばいいんじゃない？ <笑><笑> 
Yeah, people already see them as a family. <laughs> She's being a wingman. Oh. This makes me sad. Oh. Stay close forever and ever. Oh. Oh. <laughs> that hurts. That hurts me. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Of course you'd want to live here, but it's just... It's not reality. That would be so easy. She can't do that. Emilia. Emilia. Man, these characters. I love her growth so much. Are they are they actually brother and sister? I'm guessing not. Yeah. Father! Father! <laughs> Akina looks pissed off. Why? Why? Why are you crying? This is so weird. She's like... Kind of stuck. Second trial completed. No, oh, it was sad. <gasps> They're all waiting for her. She sells one more, right? This is weird. This is weird. Why are they all waiting for her here? We'll be waiting here as promised? Okay. I guess they're like, they're counting on her. Aww. Aww. あの棒屋のドナリ声を皆聞いていましたあの頑張りやがどんな気持ちでいたのかそれを知って俺は自分が情けないあの子は立派だそしてエミリア様あなたにも言えることですだから見届けさせてくださいでもなあ、see her walk out and finish that third trial。きっと無事に終わらせて、その時きちんと話をしましょう。It's a promise. 
長いしまじすぎる<笑>なんだか釈然としないけどうんありがとうすごく頑張れそうですお力になれたのならさあ、ビュージュースマイルリュウズさん、ラムがどこかわかんないラムエミリア様はエミリア様のラムはラムの And she's fighting with Puck too She's doing this for Ram. She's doing this for the villagers. For everyone. Sanctuary. Let's go, girly. I think Echidna said the last like the last two trials would be easy for her to get through. So now she's gonna confront Yeah, the future. <sighs> Happiness reflected on the water's surface. Interesting. An interesting title because she did see her reflection in the water during the present that could have happened. Also, this is very interesting because the end credits are like very water based, water focused, water themed, I should say. I feel like, okay, this episode did a great job at highlighting all these characters and like how they've grown, how they've helped people throughout the story. Amelia's present that she saw that just could not. Be real. It was very sad. Like it, it was such a beautiful moment, but of course it's very sad because you know that this just can't happen. It can never happen. And Amelia is okay with that. That like that really bugged Echidna. She was literally crying. She's like, I just I hate you. I hate you so much. And I want to get to the bottom of that. Like why? Why does Echidna hate her so much? Is because of Subaru? Maybe it's because Amelia has something that Echidna can't have? And I'm not just talking about Subaru, I mean like, I don't know, maybe Amelia has more strengths and will and hope to keep going versus what Echidna has. I'm also just trying to connect like Amelia and her friends to Echidna and like Betty and Roswell and Ryuzu. I like, I feel like I... <sighs> It's hard for me to make that connection right there still and like see similarities between them. I don't know, I just, I sense jealousy from Echidna for sure. It has to do with something more than just Subaru. I don't know, maybe it doesn't. But I'm so happy that she was able to pass the second trial. All these villagers are counting on her. You have Ram counting on her too. Or Yuzu as well. It's just very beautiful to see. And I love how much she's grown in the past few episodes the past season even like she i didn't really care for her at the end of season one but now i'm like amelia you're pretty incredible okay <laughs> i don't know how subaru and petra and all them are going to be handling this mob beast because this this crystal that they have is not working on the mob beast and so they're gonna have to maybe fight it somehow maybe betty will help i don't know betty i i feel bad for her she's just she feels resigned to her fate. I feel like she can stray away from it, right? Like, it's just depressing. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching this episode with me. I'm so excited to watch the next one, but take care. And I'll see you then. Okay, bye.